Hi guys and welcome to All Stars 7, the All Winners, RuPaul's Drag Race All Stars All Winners season live reaction. I'm so freaking excited we are here finally doing it live with you guys as it happens. And after all these years, we are here with an All Winners All Star cast. I'm so freaking excited. I apologise I didn't actually get to do the Meet the Queens or the little intro thing but i'm happy because i get to just have all this now obviously i know the cast like hello there's the eight queens incredibleness and it's going to be super fabulous and there's so much going on seriously i love catching up with you guys and a few things that i need to say basically who knew that there was going to be a double premiere on this first week so i am hella stressed with all the outfits all the things so much going on so i've got to do episode one then do episode two so the videos will just sort of get uploaded when they do when they happen when i've got a chance um but i just want to give a massive shout out to myself because obviously shout outs to me for a full series of fabulous outfits that kind of thing or at least shout outs to the past self of me where i'm revisiting outfits from different series different finales of when queens won that kind of thing so i'm super excited to sort of have this legacy with you guys because they're bringing literal winners back so why not bring my fabulous outfits back and why not celebrate the premiere episode one with the original crowned queen bb zahara cameroon benet with her leopard print and obviously she's not here but i guess with it being all stars three all stars seven like she's already kind of come back as a winner and hey there's plenty of winners like she's just she's spare she's the backup dancers okay at this point not really but <laughs> i really have to represent and do um my cute little lion king outfit which i think i did on season 11 so we're gonna have like cute little memory lane flashbacks of outfits and stuff throughout the series i have no idea if it's six episodes eight episodes how many episodes it is for this season but i'm excited i don't know anything about it there's a twist are they sending queens home i have no idea it's kind of stressful not knowing what's going on but i'm just like okay so i hope you guys are here and along for the ride i don't have too much more to say just the usual stuff like patreon I, it's kind of been a bit of a disaster and just really hard to try and get the episodes even now like hello like i'm watching a while present plus but just i hope i can get these videos to you decently and it's actually really sweating right now so i'm kind of like <laughs> that didn't th no uh -uh, outfit you know what uh, huh no ah oh, this is like you know what this is i'll blame bb if she wasn't so into like leopard print this could always be like scary spice but i'm never doing this outfit again are you for real like this is, uh, no this is a disaster in the making already um i hope you're excited for what i've got in store for this series little things like outfits new little bits and bobs oh shit i haven't actually got my lipsticks ready what if there's no eliminations we don't need lipsticks no lipsticks i'm afraid <laughs> i don't know i kind of want to do the lipsticks but maybe in episode two or three but not right now I'm, I'm really warm but i just wafted it all up in my mouth which is fab but anyway and this is obviously all star seven i was a bit miffed it's a bit weird that's been billed as all star seven but it's all winners when like we have the hall of fame so is if shay or trinity or monet wins are we going to be like here is the hall of fame and they're in there twice like i don't understand like are they the leader of the hall of fame it's a bit weird so i don't know speaking of that as well i i'm really excited to see them all back but i don't know who i want to win i feel like i'm team shay like obviously you guys saw my reaction to shay shay winning the fact that i've been here for most of these like evie's crowning jada's crowning the vivian's crowning trinity monet shay all of the winners seriously it's been absolutely fabulous and i think i'm team shay or monet monet exchange like african love them but i also just live that raja is here like it's a gag okay i just <sighs> one final thing i gotta say as well a really good friend of mine literally prepared me and he was like there's a like potential spoiler on instagram like on wednesday and i was like oh gosh no so i hid i was like oh my gosh if I have to predict the spoiler, I'm reading, like, the message. If I have to predict the spoiler, there is another queen, would be a gag. And if not, it's who goes first or what the twist is. And I was like, okay. And it was basically, I saw I saw a flash. I went on Instagram, I was like, oh my god, somebody was in, like, a black and white striped outfit with a hat. And I just, I was straight away just like, I'm a ninja. I've been doing this for four years. I'm a ninja. I know what I'm doing. It's all good. Uh, I saw a flash of whatever it was, someone in black and white gag if it's another queen i can see them doing that so i'm a bit like is it another queen is it a ninth queen and then i was like who could it be obviously we don't have like aquaria we don't have bob or sasha or bianca or obviously lawrence like uk queen. you know uh, there's a lot of winners sorry if i'm rambling but the point is i don't know what this gag twist is but it's also just a bit like 
they did this whole promo thing and there's been so much promo for it. And then are they just going to not include them as part of the promo? Or I don't understand. Because obviously they didn't announce Bibi Zahara Bane on All Stars 3 and she was a gag walk-in kind of vibe. But hey, we're just going to jump into it now because I'm excited. Like, I got it. Like, we, got, we got to do this. Like, mm, 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 mm. Oh, I love this drink. But not with my bits of fur inside. So like, hey, I might have to take these off as well. Like, anyway, let's just do this because it is All Stars 7, all winners. And you know that I had to turn up for this and turn out. And I want to see it with you guys. Like, let's just go because we ain't got time. It's a long ass episode and there's also Untucked. I think I'm going to do a separate Untucked video. Okay, that's my plan. If I can get... If I can get these in. Got my nice cute little new like AirPods for my birthday kind of vibe. But hey, oh, I feel like there's a literal fur in my ear. Okay. Ah. My winner right there. Season 9 represents. Oh, uh, I didn't know I needed an introduction. Hey, it's your girl Shea winner of All Stars 5. She looks fucking stunning. And I didn't come to slay. I, I came, came to win. win! This is literally not long ago. I mean, I know I haven't done All Stars 6 yet for you guys. I filmed it. We've done it. It'll happen after All Stars 7, okay? But I fucking love her. I just, I, I'm excited to see more. I'm always excited to see more. Like, aren't you glad to see me? <laughs> I simply Orange is the new black. That bitch. First one in the competition. First one in, again. last one out. Ah, feel so poetic. I'm here to be the queen of all queens. Hey, bitches, she's back. Hey, look over there. Jada Essence Hall. She's fierce. I don't care what y'all say. I know I want a Gigi to win, but I'm fucking pleased and happy for it. She, she did the one. Her. Essence of beauty. Winning season 12 was like a dream come true. Right at the start of this goddamn pandemic when the whole world was upside yeah, down. Yeah, and it wasn't that long ago. The damn crown. That was incredible. I watched it on Insta Live or YouTube or whatever. The first queen and the only queen to win a lip sync smackdown for the crown from home in my tiny little living room. I was really proud about that. Okay. Can't take that away from her. It's about to get odd. <laughs> That's a pretty cool look. Okay. Don't mind me. I just even the odds. One How purple, one yellow. Know? Very Splatoon. I, um, Evie Oddly, the crown queen she looks of cute. season 11 of RuPaul's Drag Race. Yuck. I was Falling there. Oddities and fly your well, I wasn't there, but I was here with Emily. That was the season 11 finale. Evie and Brooklyn and that, the edge of glory. Show absolutely oh, oh, it's one of those. Oh. <laughs> She got a long tongue, which we knew, but my god, that nipple piercing, and then just the... Not on my channel. Unless it's me. Mm -hmm. This hair is giving me elevator vibes, bitch. You push one button, it's up, then it's down, then it's <laughs> up, then it's down. I'm I thought it was giving it. me a bit like <laughs> troll doll kind of vibe, like Ariel the Snatchity, but girl. Oh, the tuck. Body, body, and more body. The Don't care what you guys Trinity say about her. I love her. <laughs> Met her twice. She's fierce. Season 9. Talented. Looks. Let's see what redemption she might earn here. Or prove or show her talent and why we love her. So, like, I, I, I you know, like, I don't care. She has traveled around the world. She had a long ass queue at DragCon UK. Obviously, it was soon after All Stars 4, like a year later after she won, kind of vibe, but. She looks fierce. Oh. Everybody looks so good. Trinity and Shay back together. Season 9. Monet changes everything. <laughs> Ooh, money. Oh, not that other gun. Not actually. Yes, honey. They're real girls. She brought her own dollars. Oh, here I am. Monet Fucking love her. Met her twice. All the twos when it comes to them too. <laughs> I know that a lot of y'all have been missing Monet exchange on your television. And y'all ask, girl, and yeah, you're, you're receiving me. My winner, like Shay and Monet, like fucking just do it. Like, that's a cute look as well. She loves a bit of like plaid, like check vibes. Better than a leotard. Sibler Rivali. Yay, Dragon UK. It was literally spelled Rivali, not rivalry. Girl. But. Totes met them. Totes had a cute picture. 
Oh, 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 yeah, and Monet got me up on stage, but like, we, we already know that. Roll a clip, but I won't roll a clip because you've seen it before. Trinity and I were the only double crowning ever, and we shared in this iconic moment in queer history. Oh my god, this, yeah. is, this is a gag. Like, uh, uh, Evie's but hair is still, still going. This all star <laughs> season, I'm not going to share anything. No, girl, I've done that before. I'm not interested this time. The workers is like tripled in size. Yeah. Maybe. They knew it was all winter, so they wanted to make the room nice and big, so we all had ample space for mm -hmm. our egos. Literally, yep. Oh. The retroness of it all. Line. <laughs> That's a line. Look at the look, it's very uh, knock-lastic. Monsoon, internationally tolerated drag queen superstar. I won season five of RuPaul's Drag Race. I've been in the same room as her. I was in like a queue for her meet and greet, 2018. Yeah, but then she had to go, so we couldn't, yeah. Didn't get to get to actually physically meet her, but. All winners, all stars, has been brought up to me many times. I guess season five wasn't enough for you, so I've come <laughs> back to do it again. We needed somebody <laughs> retro. We needed somebody of the classic bunch, like her and Raja are the two, and I'm just like, this is exciting. This is like, it must be exciting for them. Like literally queens like Shay, Evie, the new winners, to meet these icons. And I say that fittingly. Somebody call for an icon. She's literally wearing an eye. Oh my god, like the eye on season three, but like different, like oh she's still old. She's still got grey hair, but you know what? I fucking Raja, It was a different time. Queen, it was a different time I back then. <laughs> it's one of my favourite seasons. Three, six, and nine. All stars two, they're my favourites. I'm so glad they brought the season three winner back. Manila Luzon. Oh wait. Okay. Grandma's home. I love it. I love it. Winning season three catapulted me onto a global Fucking stage. The looks are everything. So I'm expecting all, all the looks for Raja on All Stars. Look, you guys, I even wore nails. I well, if you're not wearing nails, you're not doing drags. And I want Alaska to be here, but okay. The Vivian will do. Fucking representing. Hard, stiff competition. Yeah. Sorry, girls, I was feeling awfully horny. Representing the UK, hey. It's been absolutely great. It's been tremendous. Thank you. <laughs> I'll tell you one thing. I wanted Davina to win, but I was like, you know what? You I want Viv, her to. Because I know the Vivian is a bit of a mouthful. Oh, so I've been told. Okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> I mean, I've met her a few times, but I can't confirm that, so. But yeah, I really wanted her to do other Snatch games. And I was like, oh, she won. That means we're not going to get her to do Snatch game again. She's back as a fabulous Snatch game person. And I'm excited for another, another Snatch game. And she gets to make that cold, hard cash. Fucking, fucking BBC. Here is the stripe. Who the fuck is this stripe about? Who is it? What? I can't tell. Oh, it's not. I, I, I was like, who would oh, wear that? See ya. <laughs> See ya. Huh? This is the gag, and I need to know it. Security. Tell me. Oh, wait, take it off. I'm not into that. Oh, come on. <laughs> A cash prize of $200,000. Oh, and they got jaw crap? Two? Queen of all queens? No, no Hall of Fame. $200,000. That's what they spent on All Stars 4 anyway. So like, girl. <laughs> Who is it? Wait, who the fuck? It's fucking Raven. I can see under the lips. It's Raven. It's fucking Raven. I can see it under the mask. I can tell from the lips. How weird. She ain't here though to compete. Come on. She's here to do Bruce makeup. <laughs> Surprise! First alternate season. She's it's not me, she... Raven. I did not win season two, and I did not win All Stars one. The bitch, why are you here though? Sashay away. Oh, she's here to represent that bitch. Oh, I was robbed. Chad oh. Michael. <laughs> I mean, I'm fine with Chad winning twice. 
But is Raven actually here? Almost to represent season two? I'm about it. Oh. Raja and Raven together? No, she actually has me in? Are you for real? No. Ra Raja's like, bitch, I thought. I Surely a lot not. Of queens may not think that I belong in a winner's competition, but I do identify as a winner. Suck it. I mean, sort of, ah, where's my spot? You did win an Emmy. I did. Yeah. <laughs> is she for real actually competing, though? I cannot believe you're here. This is gaggy. Ooh. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I don't know what to say. It, it works, though, for, for, you know, like, season two not being there, so. Welcome to All Stars, All Winners. Yeah. Oh, fuck, I can't fucking believe Raven's like, literally, I'm still waiting for a route to pluck Raven out and be like, actually. Is gonna leave here the same way you came in. As a beloved crowned queen. Hello. Yeah. True. Except Raven. Okay, nobody take that away from you. <laughs> oh, hey, Raven. <laughs> in fact, I believe that. Wait a minute. Well, you're just gonna break. Raven, what are you doing here? <laughs> <laughs> I am here just like the rest of them to get a crown. Raven, darling, come over here. Oh, no. She's not competing, is she? I thought I was like. Oh. Um, Raven. What part of All Stars, All Winners do you not understand? All right, all right, fine. I'll go. No. Rue, walk me to my car. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so confused. Drag race royalty. Why, you ungrateful little hitter. <laughs> this battle be Asia O'Hara's Drag Race. Validate my parking. <laughs> and scene. Oh, Raven, she gets a little stunt. Cute. Give a big round of applause for Emmy Award winning makeup artist Raven. <laughs> and don't let the foundation hit you on the way out, please. <laughs> Uh, My crown queens, unlike Raven, each of you is in this competition for the long run. <laughs> and yeah. only one of you will walk away with the title Queen of All Queens. Shake a leg, shake a leg. There's a twist. Is nobody going home? Is, no, is it teams? Of course there's a twist. This RuPaul's oh, twist teams. race, okay? <laughs> this season, no one will be eliminated. Yes, this is what I, I, I need oh, to yes. see them every week. The has begun. Yes, okay. So wh what are they going to do? Ain't nobody going home. This is how I felt on All Stars 2 how when they were like, happen? I'm not Each eliminating episode, anyone. You'll compete in challenges designed to test your award-winning charisma, uniqueness, nerve, and talent. Okay. And I'll name the top two All-Stars of the week. Double lip sync, amazing, Each of yeah. Whom top two. will be awarded a legendary legend star. Oh god, I'm gonna have to buy these as well. Like the I'm wearing now. I thought I saw something up there. I'm gonna have to buy some more Rupee about just but they're then the top different. two all stars will lip sync for their legacy. Okay. The lip sync winner will receive a cash tip of ten thousand dollars. Cha-ching. Okay. Plus the power to block one of her fellow queens from receiving a legendary legend star the following week. What? So it's kind of like immunity, but reverse immunity, like. And <laughs> now that's important Ooh. because this season, winning legendary legend stars is everything. That's how you're gonna win In the, the crown. Finale, the four queens with the most legendary legend stars will compete in a lip sync Lala Perusa smackdown Ooh. for the crown. Okay. Ooh. So the top four, we've got the eight, we're gonna end with the top four, okay. One of you will be crowned the queen of all queens. Oh gosh. It's kind of a good way of keeping them all in because these are winners. We want to, I don't want to see Derek Berry for one episode and gone, like. A cash prize of $200,000. Work. 
I don't want to see Raja for one week. I don't want to see Viv for one week. I want to see them week after week, all their looks, all what they've got to bring. So this kind of works. Don't know how many episodes it is like, but... Because reading is a what? Fundamental. Oh, pet crew. Oh, it's him. <gasps> we haven't had pet crew in so long, it feels like. Oh, sis. That's a lot of meat. <laughs> Monsoon. I finally realized where the last name comes from. I have never seen anyone that can blow quite like you. <laughs> it's because I suck a lot of dick. Yeah, she a whore. <laughs> so Vivian, I, uh... I want to personally thank you for agreeing to come and be the diversity hire this season of Drag Race. <laughs> I am so glad, bitch, that I was able to work with you this summer to see for myself that you don't stink. <laughs> it's just your drag, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Trinity the Tuck, okay? Oh. I'll have no reads for you, bitch. You are the realest bitch in this season from the knees down. Okay? Uh, legit. <laughs> Shay kool -Aid. I'm very glad that Sasha could not be here because we don't have to hear talk about roses, but we do have to look out for that rosebud of yours. Ooh. That's ma'am. She don't think she has a rosebud. Oh, well. <laughs> I don't think so. Some of us are not so lucky. <laughs> Trinity the Tuck. You know, I didn't want to have to make any of those throwaway filler jokes, but Rue's the one who crowned you. Well, halfway. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> Wonder Twin Powers activate! Yes! yes! <laughs> Evie Oddly. Yeah. Your dad is so hot. <laughs> I know, right? What happened? Oh. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> to Vivian, those lips are so big when you floss your teeth, it looks like my ass wearing a thong. <laughs> Her lips are smaller than yours, Trinity. <laughs> Raja, boot. <laughs> <gasps> yes! <laughs> Shada Essence Hall, the only queen to win Drag Race on a fucking Zoom call. <laughs> <laughs> Jinx Monsoon. You know, looking at you, your teeth really represent the cast here. Some are big, some are small, <laughs> two of them are white, no, three of them are white. <laughs> <laughs> some are cracked. Aww, what a great Jada compliment. Look over there, it's the exit. <laughs> <laughs> you've always been like a sister. You've always been like a You've always been like a grandmother to me. <laughs> you know they say Gemini's have two faces. Have you been putting the good makeup on the other face? <laughs> okay, that was good. Oh, Monet. People are always comparing Monet to Bob the Drag Queen, and I don't think that's right, and I don't think that's fair. No, it's not. Bob is very talented. <laughs> True. And that's all we're going to say about that. That's my time. <laughs> o O G E R S Boogers. There we go. <laughs> Hey, she likes a quick read, she likes a short and snappy and reference in season three with the headless and boogers. She's a tuck. It kind of works. Always known as the body, but never the face. Oh. <laughs> now, Jinx Monsoon, in order to read you, I'm going to imagine you naked. Oh, that's how I lost that weight. <laughs> <laughs> Monet Exchange. Now, not a lot of people know, Monet is a very talented singer. That's because she's not. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I like yeah, her EP. Girls are shady. <laughs> I feel like, well, I'll give it to Jinx. The winner maybe. Of today's mini challenge is Jinx Monsoon. Yeah! Shady Queen. For your first All Star Maxi Challenge, you'll be collaborating on my new song, oh! Legends. Yeah! Okay. <laughs> yes, ma'am. You need to it's write your own sickening verses. Oh gosh, eight verses. Oh girl. I don't know if I'm going to be able to include much of this audio, but I'm excited for a new song. Legends. It's not the one from season nine. Legends rise with all. What becomes a legend most? Don't ask me. Ask oh, her. I know what happens. Yeah, from the promo. What? Is this when oh, Shay loses her shit? Who's her? Oh God. <laughs> 
Premier, Guest Judge, Naomi Campbell, work. Oh, shame. Like, a, a dream come true for her. Like, Naomi Campbell. <laughs> work. I am about to pass out. Oh. I'm talking in the <laughs> church aisle with the church mothers fanning me. She's like legit shaking. Out. Like you can tell. Like, Please she, give wow. a warm drag race. That'd be like Gaga for me. Like. One and only Naomi Campbell. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Hello, ladies. <laughs> I love what you've done with your empire. Oh, thank you. I bet you say that to all the moguls. No, I do not. <laughs> I do not. <laughs> so I'm going to give you a master class to how to put the base into your walk. You up for it? Absolutely. I need to know all about runways. I'm the runway queen. The runway queen. Walk, work, serve. What is she going to say about Raja? The poses are great. Your walk for me is great. Thank you. Thank you, Naomi. Thank you. When I was in school and I'd go into a hallway, if there was no one in that hallway, then I'd just be like, bam, 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 bam. I would totally bam, do that bam. now, like She's for real. So smooth. Yeah. Very, I don't give a damn. And I like that runway. Yeah. I do. Yeah. Our British Queen. Up next. Here we go. Shea Coulee. It is the most sick meets bougie. iconic thing to be walking on the runway in front of Naomi Campbell. And this is my moment to show my teacher all that I've learned. Aww. Well, Shea Coulee. Hi. When did you start learning how to walk? When I was probably nine years old. I would put on this very specific video of you walking in the Victoria's Secret fashion show. You had on this beautiful beaded fringe and the way that you made that fringe sway, it lives in my mind rent free. Girl, when I'm going to get milk from the grocery store, <laughs> I will be, I, that is what I channel. Yeah, it shows you do. Oh. You know what you're doing, you have it controlled, you know how to slow it down, to bring it up, to, it was perfection for me. Wow. Gag. Uh, uh, I, well, um, <laughs> There aren't enough words to describe the impact that you've had on me. Oh, sis. Shay made me cry when she won. Oh, bitch. Made me fucking cry. <laughs> she doing this? She doing I just it? really look up to you a lot, and oh. it was really amazing to be able to get up on this runway and walk in front of you. I'd spend my whole life practicing for a moment like that. Pleasure to meet you. You know what? She doesn't even need a win. She doesn't need to be there. She just got what she wanted. Like, can you imagine? All of these queens are immeasurable. They're insurmountable. Do I know the definition to that word? No, but I know that they be as. And each and every one of them came to win. Imagine, like, being just in a room full of winners. It would be so intimidating. Like, what if I accidentally won and I'm just like, oh, shit. Now I'm here with actual royalty, like... <laughs> God, I ain't got lashes on and I'm still pretty. You are, bitch. You are a pretty bitch. And I'm gonna push you down. <laughs> I can't believe five years later, here we are. Trinity and, Mo Trinity and Monet. Trinity and Shay together. Season 9, my first season, my favourite season. All the important things to me and... Both sitting here winners? Ready to kill it on an all-winner season. Queen of Queens. Editors, please insert echoing sounds. Put a little reverb on that. The Queen of That's Queens. That's me. The Queen of Queens. The YouTube, like, self-proclaimed outfit, inspired reaction, channel vibe. C-U-N Trinity. Oh. The best thing about this legendary season, bitch, is that we could take chances on ourselves because no bitch is going home. You could take a risk and try something you've never done just to show the audience a new side of you. So you're gonna sing it? Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> I remember season 12 entrance and she couldn't sing. Hey. It's like Kennedy says, don't try something new. Stick to what you know. Well, you know what? All winners, try something new. Do the thing. Evie Oddly wants to do whatever the fuck she wants to do and she doesn't care. 
I think they've already proven what they needed to. Now it's just have fun. We're back for fun, like. What if we started in like a picture, some of us down lower? Because I think it would be really cool with the way the music. Like an goes. all winners picture, like season eight, episode 100. The problem with so many talented people all trying to share a stage mm -hmm. is. You know what we should do? We should do no, like a friendly battle. Maybe save that for the battle at the end. Or we could do this dance from the 80s. <laughs> <laughs> oh, a wealth of good ideas. Mm -hmm. I'm a one man show. I'm a one person show. I'm a one queen show. I do what I got to do. The, the credits is Sean, Sean, Sean. Sound, audio, editing, outfit, and choreography, ideas, sass, fabulousness, drinks, penis straws, shade fans, outfits again, more outfits, when I upload, it's all me. Credits, just me. Nobody else. Starring me. Write the theme tune, sing the theme tune. Me. I don't know what it is about this whole winter season, but I feel like I'm being all, like, prima donna and, like, pretend that I'm amazing, but, like, y'all know me, like, no. It's all good. <laughs> I'm just me. I'm just excited to be back. You're now seeing how hard this competition is gonna be because everybody is good. I mean, like, there is not a filler queen here. I mean, there are some fillers in some queens, but there's not a filler queen. True and true. Like, I, I don't know who I would have picked to go first. Who would you pick to go first? Like, not Raj and not Jinx. Not the ones you might think. Not Trinity, not Monet. But... We all know they're gonna slay. On the fly. So for me, it feels like a game of chess and you kind of got the first move. So this decision sets the pace for how the rest of the competition, competition is going out. to roll out. My strategy for All Stars 5 was, you know, I'm always going to vote on who I feel was the weakest that week. The issue with this version is like why would we block, block one a weak of the weak one. one that's what i'm saying you know? and, yeah true so, exactly you have to play the game strategically you want to get it to the top four you got to block your competition so that way you can get the stars how else are you supposed to play this game you're gonna block the weakest competitor that don't make no sense they ain't gonna win no stars anyway okay so do you think blocking is kind of a compliment <laughs> right <laughs> Potentially, yeah. Oh, they're gonna start blocking Shane. She's not gonna get any stars. Bitch, when the strategy starts tonight, people are going to be in their feelings. What is the strategy you're gonna play on? I I really don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Can we like do we do we do an alliance? Do we? Bitch, if you wanna do an alliance, I wanna do an alliance. Okay, I'm done. about this. The, the, the all stars for like, like getting at each other. Uh -huh. And if you and I have an alliance together, bitch, I won't. I'm mm -hmm. very dumb, I'm very serious. Trinity is very competitive. She's a strong player in Drag Race. So. Monet's also that vibe though. She's also a bet Betty. She's petty. She's a petty Betty. If somebody blocks her, she's gonna block them the next week. She's trying to get Trinity to not block her. She's trying to, you know, categorize it and work it out. And she's not, she's smart. I like it. Imagine if they made the top four though, like super queen all over again. I will lie, cheat, Steal a crown if I have to. I mean, maybe, yeah. maybe don't I do just that. say, let's team up. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, she asked me if I could help her stone. And I'm like, uh, you just oh, stand yeah, in there, girl. Yeah, help yeah. me, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. And I remember hugging Manila, and like in her ear, I'm like, oh, my God, I'm crying so ugly. I feel like I look like an asshole. And she's like, you are an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love and it. And then we became besties. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very happy here. Bitch, your season was the season I started watching. You made me fall in love with drag. I remember watching I you on TV with Dita Von Teese, uh, teaching the models burlesque. Oh, yes. Yeah. And I was, I, I looked up to you and I thought that was so cool. And I was a teenager. <laughs> <laughs> you were only on two years later. <laughs> Jada, how did you feel about winning? The hardest part about the win for me was that because of the pandemic, I didn't get to like travel the world and like yeah. Feel my hope, bitch. I'm the winner confidence. It's like if somebody told you you won the lottery, but you can't touch it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Very that. But 100%. You are that fear. Yeah. Thank you. you. Are that yeah, and I oh, think yeah. I think like I'm I'm learning to know that all the time, and trying to like work getting past 
being here. And like, I, I come here and I compete with y'all and it just makes me feel so good because I'm like, the oh, level of, oh, the level oh, of like, thickening that all of y'all possess, I'm like, it's good to know that like, I deserve to be here just as much as anybody. She got the fucking crown, so yes, she does. Like, she ain't Raven. Like, she fucking I'm deserves it. I was nervous about like, I was like, I don't mm. know like how it would be because I'm sometimes very closed oh. off. But I'm so glad to be here with y'all. I'm so happy here. <laughs> you deserve to be here. You Thank are you. deserving. Oh, know that. Yes. I feel really excited to be competing with the cream de la creme. Is that creme de la creme? It's not the ben de la creme. Besides, Trixie's not even here, so. <laughs> <laughs> Drag Race, all stars, all winners. That is a look. That is some stripey, all the things. Rue turned, I hope she turns out some looks for this season. She's been saving them for this season, obviously. Like, she looks good. I love that hair. Cameron Diaz, though. And Kevin must be missing an angel because she's here with us tonight. She Cameron looks stunning. Diaz. I thought that this was heaven, Rue. Literally. <laughs> like, the first thing I think I knew her from was the mask. Love the mask. I love the holiday. Shrek, fucking incredible. Category is uncrowning. <laughs> <laughs> okay, they should all come out and wear their crowns. They better, they look fierce. Is that Raja in the blonde? Wow, oh my God. Ah! I love it. Okay, Monet was everything. Raja was fucking fierce. Jinx funny. Raja, yes. Monet knows what she's doing. Like, love it. Oh, fuck it. Trinity looks incredible. Oh my god. These looks are so. Oh my god, that hair. Come on, Donatella. Oh! Come on, Vivian. I'm getting chills now because I know it's Jada and Shay left and I'm like, Shay, come on, like, are they saving Shay for last? Oh. Oh, Raja, what are you doing? Oh, no. <laughs> yes, yes, that hair. Ooh, Miss Thing, you better be. Okay, that was fierce. Hey. It's better than that All Stars 5 song, anyway. This is fucking everything. We're we're watching an all-winner season right now. This is just... This is just everything. Fierce. I want to know the song. I want to download it. I want to lip-sync to it. I was impressed. Monet, Raja, Shay, Trinity, Vivian. They were, like, my favourites. Category is... I'm crowning. First up, Raja. Oh, my God. Oh. I gotta get so emotional. This is only the first runway, I swear to God. She looks fucking incredible. She's wearing a crown. They better all be wearing crowns, I swear to God. Have you seen this look? I love it. I just, oh, we're not worthy. Oh, they're coming out in order. Oh my God. This is fucking smudged my- I don't know, is it actually- ah! <laughs> Oh, it's barely- it's barely touched the sides. Don't touch it. Oh my god. Oh no. This is fucking hilarious. I love that. At least she looks great. That's just- that's stunning. It's- I love the collage. Oh wow, trans lives matter. Look at those shoes, those heels. She looks good. Oh fuck. Oh. 
She knows pageant. She knows gown. The train. We can have a little picnic on that. Can I come? We can have... We can fit like 10 people. We can have a little kiki. We can have a little kai kai if you want. I don't know. We can have something. She looks fucking fierce. And the color combination is Gorgina. I bet they needed more suitcases than five this time. Oh, cute. Rainbow vibes. Those heels. The Gaga heels. Wow. Okay, that was... That's pretty fierce. I can't say that I, like, live it compared to the others, but hey. Wow. Interesting. She looks good. It feels like something Valentina would wear. Like, All Stars 4 kind of vibe. I like the scepter. It's kind of like a spine skeleton scepter. She looks good. I, I can't say I like it as much as some of the others. Marsh Simpson. <laughs> It's good. It's okay. It's cute. I don't know. She's the fucking queen. She's the winner. She's looking. Have you seen her? Have you seen her? The hair. The, the, the. I can't deal. I can't deal with it. Yeah. The only thing is, like, the crown is like braid, so I guess that kind of counts. But you know what it is. She is fucking everything. Best looks, Raja, Shay, Trinity, and even Jinx. They were fabulous. Tonight, I'll name the top two all-stars of the week and award each of them a legendary Shay. legend star. Come on, I give it a Shay. I'm so happy to Hi, see Michelle. you. It's been so long. Your crowning look Michelle's is first season. so fun. This is what I would expect from you. The level of detail, the level of story, the craftsmanship, this is all world class. It's what Raja, we need is. I'm just gobsmacked in the performance. Your artistry, your expression. I felt like it was very sort of Blade Runner, futuristic. You look phenomenal. There was just a part where she wasn't performing when someone else was on. She kind of just walked away like, oh, what do I do? Like. Right up next, Jinx Monsoon. Water off a duck back. <laughs> Water off a duck's back. This is absolutely beautiful. The crown with all of the rays, the gown, the modernized slit to show she's still a little hoe underneath all of this <laughs> finery. I mean, you were just drop dead sexy in that performance. You came out and you killed it. I think her performance was incredible. Like as, you know. This look is so great. It's cool. It's really like very Monet, different, regal to me. Not so much like I, I'm not getting like what Raja and Drinx did, but I kind of could see her in the top two, so. You are very much a look queen, so I expect nothing less from you than to come out in a dress that you can't move in. <laughs> uh, but it's really, really beautiful. The rich. But it looks good. Like, who cares about functionality? Like, it, it looks During good. During the performance, I could not take my eyes off of you. You are a show Work. girl. You were literally getting. Is this going to be a season nine top two? Shay and Trinity? Is it All Stars 4 top two? Trinity and Monet? Girl, I was feeling the fantasy. I don't know any of the lyrics. <laughs> <laughs> I was living my life. Yeah, okay. Fair. Evie Oddly. It's like a kid who like got into all the crayons. I, I loved every part of it. Thank you. Let the kids play with all the crayons in the box now. All the colors. All the things. Cameron Diaz. Up next. Shay Coulee. Hi. That performance you slay. was so strong. You came onto that stage and just let everybody have it. You gave me chills up my arm, and I was like, whoa, I just got Kool Aid. <laughs> <laughs> Drink the Kool Aid. She's she's in the fucking top two. She's got it, but she's, I just want her to win. I'm saying it now. We already know, like, episode one, I want Shay to win. I need her to win. I don't need her to win. She already did. And I feel relieved. We did the All-Stars thing. All-Stars 5. But I would like her to win. I would like her to win. Who do you want to win? Like, everyone has their favourites. Somebody loves Jinx. Somebody loves Trinity. Somebody loves Monet. Somebody loves Raja. Everybody wants somebody to win. Who do you want? Who is your top two? Who is your top four? Shay. Shay. Shay, Shay, Shay. 
Trinity is a showgirl. She yeah. is captivating. She's got star quality. And I could tell she didn't know any of those lyrics. No. But I did not care. No. Because she I didn't is know so is to be watchable. Fair. She was living. When those guys lifted oh. her up, she knew exactly the right attitude for that number, and it sold it. I don't want to put a damper on things, but we have to care about not knowing the lyrics in right. this company because look at these True. bitches. Everybody's so great. You're right. You're right. You and she mean? did write the lyrics. Thank you. So she should know them. <laughs> yeah, it definitely was not. Yeah, that. it's giving me a bit of like Call Me Mother vibes. Isn't it RuPaul who didn't know the lyrics, took five days to learn it and do that? Yeah, 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 exactly. If you're going to write the lyrics, you're going to know the lyrics. Mm -hmm. But two of you truly made us gag. The top Shane two Monet, come on. stars of the week are Shane Monet. Shane Monet. My top two, so come on. Shane Coulet. Yes. And Monet Exchange. Yes. Oh my God, you. you, you just, uh, she got changed. Wait, do they already know they won? They, they've already got changed. You've each ready to lip sync. A legendary so. legend star. And you're both one step closer. To our grand finale, Ding. lip sync Lala Perusa Smackdown for the crown. Amazing. Actually, to be fair, Evie got changed. I think a few of them might have got changed, but we'll be seeing Two it in Untucked. Stand before me. <sighs> These Shay. better be some good songs. They need to Monet. turn it out for this all is your winners. Chance to impress me, win ten thousand mm dollars, -hmm. and earn the power to block one of your fellow queens. From receiving a legendary legend star next week. Oh my god. I love you both so much. <laughs> <laughs> Sucking up. Oh, we've got alliances. Trinity safe if Monet wins. The time has come for you to lip sync for your legacy. <sighs> These are lip sync assassins. Oh, McDonald had a farm. He had some lines here, some lines there, and ah, what the fuck's going on with this lip sync? At least this is showing they could do like Shay could do comedy, but Monet she's fabulous at comedy. But like, I want to know what you guys. Everyone, I'm just imagining everyone's thoughts on this song. Like, what the fuck? I, I'm I need a drink break. Hang on. <laughs> Brown cow <is> stunning. <laughs> they did what they had to with that song. They both brought the comedy. I don't know who I'd give it to. Maybe Shay, but Monet was still doing fabulous. So, so what the fuck? <laughs> and there's a, a duck here and a duck there. <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck was that? Where's my Ariana Grande rain on me? Like, <laughs> Shay Coulee. Congratulations, you're a winner, baby. She's already a cash tip the front runner. $10,000. Monet Exchange, you are free to slay another day. You may step to the back of the stage. Who's she gonna block? Who's she gonna block? I take it they don't have like lipsticks to sort of. They might have the lipsticks with the names on. Check. I don't know. With great power comes great She has something behind her back, actually. Maybe it Using is a the platinum plunger. Oh. Oh. It's Show not a lipstick. Which queen you have chosen to block. Get some notes. Uh, yeah. Give me a plunger for next week and I'll start rhinestone a million in it. Directions Thank you. On how I can play this. I'm setting the tone for the rest of the competition. And I know these girls are shaking in their boots. I love you, bitch. <laughs> Please don't give it a Trinity. Don't touch me. This is interesting. Give it to Jinx I or Rock really Drink. Ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Here ahead, there ahead, everywhere ahead, ahead. I was rooting for you in season nine. <laughs> Good. Are you sure? I think Jinx is the competition, so. Oh, don't block me! <laughs> <laughs> hey, you had your mom with Carmen that time on that lip sync. Attention. 
mansion. They love to build it. I think it's gonna be Jinx. I think it's Jinx. You're <gasps> Bitch, this ain't RuPaul's Drag Race Season well, 9 best friend race no more. <laughs> so Trinity, oh, no. next week you can compete and even win. But Shay has blocked you from earning a legendary legend star. So they can still win then, fair enough. Girl, there is so much to discuss going on from that episode seriously, but we need to crack on to Untucked, so I'm going to end this video. We'll do an Untucked video separate, but I'm excited to see more. We've obviously got the Snatch Game the next episode. Straight away, I'm going to have to get out of all this into the Snatch Game. Like, I'm freaking loving it. Let me know all your thoughts in the comments below. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Subscribe, all the good stuff. I really appreciate it because we're here to stay and here to slay for all winter season this time, and it's going to be absolutely incredible. And... It seems to have unsubscribed a few people like as the time's gone on because I haven't been posting and stuff. So hey, if you want to, I appreciate it. I've also got my gaming channel, Shawnee underscore 92 and Twitch, Shawnee underscore 92. I'm doing all the things, so much busyness. I'm just freaking loving it. What was that lip sync song? Let me know everything in the comments. There's a lot to happen, a lot to come. Episode one, untucked as well. Episode two, then untucked. So, so many videos this week. See what happens. I don't know. Let me get into the untucked though, seriously. And stay safe, everyone. I'll see you very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.